Hey everybody, Troy here, back for another episode of Elite Dangerous, and in this episode I'm going to be going on a very long distance journey. This one I'm actually going to be taking a rare good 160 light years away, actually approximately 177, to a destination so I can sell it for maximum profit. <laughs> Alright, and as you can see here, I went ahead and got myself a Type 6 transporter. Now this one is uh, an upgrade from my Cobra, which I was primarily using for trading and some light bounty hunting. But I found that the risk reward was just too great, because the Cobra cost a lot to replace, and every time I seemed to make any money on it, I'd get killed because the Federals decided I was a target. So I've gone ahead and just gone full bore trading right now, because I'm trying to make as much money as possible. That said, I went ahead and got my Type 6. So if I go over here to the outfitting, you can see what I've done to the thing. I've gone ahead and upgraded my power plant to be a little bit lighter, my thrusters to do the same thing, my frameshift drive for obvious reasons, my power distributor again to save weight and give me a little bit of extra boost if I ever get interdicted. My sensors have been upgraded because I'm also doing some exploration in this. And I have uh, all of my cargo capacity almost up to max. This one right here and these two right here are not up yet because I haven't made enough money to upgrade them. And then um, uh, I have a fuel scoop so I can save money on fuel costs because this thing has a big tank. And my basic discovery scanner would be upgraded if I could find one at a decent price, but I can't. So, anyway, onto the goods. So what I've found here is if I go to the commodities market, I'm in the Boscovich ring, and I have, I can't pronounce this, but Bellalians, I don't know, Ray Leather, and I've, ooh, I can buy more? I thought you couldn't do that. Hold up. What else did I buy? bought these. I'm going to go ahead and take the hit. Sell those. Go back here and buy the rest. And there we go. All right, cool. So I went ahead and bought some more of these and I thought that you couldn't sit in the station anymore and actually find more of these, but apparently you can. And uh, needless to say, if this pays out, I'll be back. But anyway, where I'm going to be heading today is Azaban City. Now, I don't think I'm going to be able to look at it and plot a direct route there, but I'm going to try. So let's go ahead and go over here to the galaxy map. And I'm going to go up here and type in Irinin. Nope, I can't plot a direct route. So what I'm going to have to do is over here to the side a little bit. Hmm, I guess I'm gonna have to do this a little bit at a time. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and start my route up to here and get pretty close and then change my route as I get closer to this destination. So let's go ahead and plot that route. In fact, let's go ahead and plot it right to here because this is a junction. And let's begin. So let's make sure that there is no more leather. So let's exit out of here and go back in. And nope, no more. Okay. So see that's all good that's all good let's go ahead and refuel so i can get my everything ready to go i don't really want to waste time doing that but there's going to be a lot of editing in this one so uh yeah this is going to be a lot of close calls to the sun so get ready for that and the type 6 probably has the best cockpit for really like this cockpit. Ship released. Engines engaged. Landing gear retracted.
guys. See you on the other side. Frameship drive charging. Three, two, one, engage. Basically what I'm going to do is every time I find a star system that I don't know, I'm going to scan the North Sun, and just to save time I'm going to hit the D-scan, and then after that I'm just going to get out of here. Even though that's a really good system to explore and get some credits on, I am not there to do that right now. Now the thing about the Type 6 is that it is does run a bit hot, so upgrading the engine and the thrusters actually helps quite a bit in being able to jump pretty quickly after you warp into a system. It makes it a lot easier to use this ship. And also the upgraded thrusters help you with parking, because this thing is pretty unwieldy, so just a quick tip. Otherwise, enjoy the ride. Still can't plot the route, so... Alright, that's good enough for right now. So let's go that way. Friendship drive charging. Drive charging. Ready to engage. 
Jesus. Pulled me right in. That was awesome. <laughs> Probably trying to interdict me. Yeah, he is. The bad system, man. Fall into a sun and get interdicted all at the same time. Hell of a system. Friendship drive charging. Fuel scooping. Still can't plot a reboot. Let's go to Lalande. I recognize that. Hopefully we can make it to Arena. See that before. That hangs little things. Let's see you guys later. Yep. Eva. 
That's gonna miss it. We have little faith. Suck if I crashed right now. We won't talk about that. We made it. We made it, guys. Let's go ahead and see what kind of profit this brings in. Hello, Azaban. Okay, that's gonna hurt, but about 2,250 credits for the repair, and that's there. And then about another 700, so a little over 32. About 3,300 in repairs, because I'm not getting fuel, I don't have to. And then let's go down here to the commodities market, and let's see, first let's sell our tea. Big whoop, that was just because we could. 7,000, alright, so we're already above. Oh. Bye. There we go. And, uh, let's see here, where's the other thing? There we go. So... Yeah, I am. I bought these for four grand a pop, and they are worth sixteen nine four nine. So seventeen grand a pop. That's a heck of a profit. So, yeah, let's go ahead and sell these. That is a profit of one hundred and seventy six thousand seven hundred and thirty seven credits. That's pretty good for some jumping around and some sightseeing. So, uh, I'm gonna take it. I'm gonna take it. Oh, that's awesome. And let's just see here. Just 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 for the credit. Yeah, yeah, that's great. That's that's the best profit I've had so far. So I'm really happy about that. 177. Round it up. All right, and let's go over here to the cartographics and let's see what the cherry on top is. Because only one of these, and it was like 600 bucks did I have before we left off. So, 273. Alrighty, so about an extra 3,500 credits there, so yeah, that's about 200,000 plus the 7, so about 207, 208,000 profit with about 3,000 in repairs, so about 205,000 credit profit for that trip. So yeah, worth it? Yes, definitely. You see something rare, take it 160 light years in a direction, and have some fun with that payday because uh i sure as heck did so guys thank you for watching if you like this please leave a like if you want to see something else let me know and uh i'll see you guys next time peace
All of them. 